Good morning, George. You are looking great. Your coat's feeling great. And you're eating well. And I'm so glad to see that you're doing as well as you are. I'll see you later, buddy. Good morning, Henry. I have to go buy my Christmas breakfast. Wish me luck. Hello, Wibbly. You look bright-eyed and bushy-tailed. How are you today? Good to hear. Well, hello, everyone. Welcome to day 19 of Vlogmas. Can you believe it? We are almost there. And last week, when I went to Jungle Gyms, I forgot to buy the things that I needed to have my breakfast for Christmas. Every year for Christmas, I fix something, and it's kind of like my personal tradition that I do. It's not any kind of family tradition. It's not necessarily a tradition that I know of, but it's something I like to do for me on Christmas morning. And so I need to go buy those items so I can do that. And I thought I'd take you with me. So let's get started with the day. And this is where I wanted to bring you, Swenson's Drive-In. And this is great. You can eat in your car and have social distancing. And here's their menu. They have sandwiches, crispy extras, dinners, milkshakes, fountain drinks, and desserts. I got the fish and chips dinner. Give me a few minutes to eat and I'll give you my review. As you can see, I enjoyed my meal. At first, when I received my meal, I was a little disappointed in the way the fish patties looked. They looked like something you'd get in a first grade uh, school lunch, but it makes sense. They were easier to eat. I mean, you don't really want a, a fish patty like the ones you get in a pub and to eat in the car because it would be very messy. So it was really good. The fish patties I'd give, I'd say a C. It was average. The french fries I would give maybe a B minus. Uh, they have a biscuit that comes with this and it's seasoned and I'd give that a B plus and I would give the coleslaw a B plus and for value I would give it an A for my fish and chips meal it was only seven dollars and ninety five cents I would definitely come back here again but now I think it's time to leave We're here. Let's go get some things for Christmas breakfast. So here's the English section. Now I have to see if they have my stuff in stock. You know, all the times that I've been here, I've never noticed they had Excalibur. Good news, it looks like they've stocked up. And here is their frozen section, and it looks well stocked. And of course in the English section, they have tons of tea. Time to head home, and I'll show you what I bought. And here's what I bought from Jungle Gym. I bought the tin of vanilla fudge. I don't care much for the fudge, but I like the tin, and you'll see why. I also bought some Brody's Scottish Afternoon Tea. 
I've never had Brody's before, so I'm looking forward to trying it. And what a great addition to tea, biscuits. I have some chocolate and strawberry biscuits. I know, it's an addiction. And here's what I bought for my Christmas breakfast. Starting off with Heinz beans. In addition, I have blood pudding and white pudding, as well as eggs, some Irish style bacon, and HP sauce. Now all I need is a fresh tomato and fresh mushrooms, and my breakfast will be complete. And now, time for the Christmas Story Advent Calendar. Since the whole left side of the calendar is open, I thought I would open the rest of the right side. So I will go for this door tonight. Give me a second and I'll pry it open. Okay, here we go. Oh, look! It's his little Orphan Annie decoder button. That's where he found out he needed to drink his Ovaltine. Let me remove it from the calendar and I'll give you a better look. So here it is. And in case you're wondering, these are just decals. It doesn't really work. Extreme disappointment! But that's okay. We have plenty of other cool figures. And I still like it. And hopefully you liked tonight's Vlogmas. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Be sure to like, subscribe, and ring the notification bell. And until next time, everyone, this is Cashew, signing off.